This video is called Switching to a 2D View, and it is the first video that goes with Chapter 4 in Google SketchUp for Dummies. Okay, there's really only two things that you need to do to set up to be in a 2D view in SketchUp, especially when you draw, uh, when you want to start drawing a floor plan or something like that. So the first thing we're going to do is I'm going to uh, remove Bryce. So let's just click on him, and then I'm going to hit Delete to get rid of him. Now, the first thing I'm going to do actually I guess this is the second thing I'm gonna do is go up to the camera menu and go to standard and top now what we did is we changed our view our camera view so that instead of being in kind of a three-quarter view like we were before we're in a top view meaning we're looking down from the sky straight down at the ground which is why we can see the green axis and the red axis but we can't see the blue axis watch I'm gonna orbit and show you what we did see as I orbit you'll see there's the green axis there's the red axis and there's the blue axis what we did is we positioned ourselves to be right on top. Now, you can't do that with the Orbit tool by yourself. You have to go to Camera, Standard, Top to get perfectly into a top view so that you can see um, things from the top. Third thing, I was going to say second, but I guess I mean the third. The third thing that you need to do is go up to the Camera menu and switch from a perspective viewing mode to a parallel projection viewing mode. Now, perspective means that um, you're seeing things just the same way that you see them in real life, meaning parallel lines uh, recede as they go back into the distance. Don't want to model that way when we're just drawing in 2D to do like a floor plan um, because it just confuses things. So instead of do being in perspective, we're going to switch into parallel projection mode. And it's kind of hard to explain what that means really, but what it means is we're no longer using perspective. Those are the three things you need to do in order to switch into a 2D viewing mode uh, before you start drawing a floor plan in SketchUp. That's the end of the first video for the fourth chapter in Google SketchUp for Dummies.